If you want to add some freaking awesome glowing decals to Rocket League or Blue Painty tires or even Rainbow tires, keep watching this video, give me a like and don't forget to subscribe. Mm, no, I'm just joking. In this video I will show you how to install mods to Rocket League and everything you need to know about it. So first thing you will need is to download the UMod from link under video description or somewhere on Reddit. Once you have downloaded the UMod, extract it and open it up and turn global hook on in main tab. Then click to add game and find up Rocket League. Default location of game is Steam Library, Steam Apps, Common, Rocket League, Binaries, Win32 and add rocketleague.exe. Then open up your internet browser, in my case Google Chrome and open up rocketleaguemod.com and you can choose any mod you like here and then click to download button. What this modding does is just replacing existing textures of your Rocket League stuff. For example, these rainbow tires will only work on vortex wheels or these glowing octane decals will only work on octane car. So if you understand to that, rest of the video will be easy for you. Ok, now let's add fireball instead of regular boring one. Go to rocketleaguemods.com and find fireball mod. Then download it and after that extract it with something like 7zip or winrar. Then launch Rocket League and in the mod you should find new tab called Rocket League. Click on that and put new textures anywhere to white area. Now if you will open Rocket League you should be able to see new texture of ball. Or let's for example add some new tires to my octane or LED lights. Again download it from Rocket League mods and copyright textures for Octane from downloaded zip to U mod. And that's pretty much it. If you want to go more deep into modding, you can also create your own textures or decals for your car or create custom boost indicators or time and score table. For that you will need something which can work with .dss files. You can use Photoshop with plugin, but that's not working correctly for me. So I downloaded a program called paint.net which is free and can edit or create .dss files. I will put links for everything into video description. After that you have to download default boost and time indicator and just simply do with it anything you want. I just add my channel logo or kappa face and it works perfectly. If you are saving .dss files just choose dx3 instead of 1 and save it with default name. That's important. And now in game, you can see we got new boost texture with my logo and another one with kappa face. But if you can't see your new textures, try to right click to you mod and click to update or reload. If you are done with modding and you want to play with these textures every time you launch Rocket League, you have to create template by pressing main tab and then creating template. Then if you launch you mod, you will have to load templates again and it should work. Ok guys, that will be everything for today. If you want something more complicated like creating own flex or car decals, let me know in comments below. If this video was helpful, please give it a like or subscribe and I will see you next time. Bye!